funded by the taxpayer, correct? Yeah, I mean, I mean, obviously our, our main focus is increasing access, access to care. But it is worth it because we are saving a life here. Care for uh, the individual, but certainly if you look uh, overall, um, there's a lot more expenses associated with going to America or going out of province or even going overseas for uh, funded surgeries, of course. Oh no, I have some bad news. I think right up here is some more tumors. Let's look. Yep, that is accurate. This is amazing. So, so three surgeries already done this week, correct? Yeah, so we, um, we started uh, the vaginoplasty surgery, which is a new uh, part of our program. Our program's been around for a year and a half, and we have plastic surgery and gynecology and urology and many different uh, other disciplines within our program, uh, PT, nursing, social worker. But um, we uh, started the vaginoplasty on Monday, Tuesday, and today will be our last of three with our mentor, Dr. Marcy Bowers, who's mentoring myself and Dr. Ethan Grober, my uh, co-pilot in the operating room. Oh, sure, we're going to have here. I'm just feeling the skin and take this piece that we removed. Okay, I think what we're going to do is go ahead and put some surgical tape on the edges. So, you know, we don't have a lot of time, unfortunately, but I mean, you, you touched on this in terms of how we got here a little bit. Uh, in terms of the funding, you know, a bit of a checkered history, does it not? Yeah, I mean, these are uh, publicly funded uh, surgeries, so um, uh, the government does support them. Excuse me. And that'll be that. These will hold the incision closed until it starts to heal from the inside out. And, and the, the barrier and the unique part is now these are uh, locally available. So let's move this patient over a bit. Can you grab him, nurse? All right, thank you. Yep, that's fine. He's ready to go to recovery. 